Coming to this country, I had big dreams. America, the land of opportunity, where anything felt possible. But the world of television, it felt like a closed door. The gatekeepers weren't ready to let me in. I remember the sting of rejection, the feeling of being unseen, unheard. But within those setbacks, a fire ignited. I knew my voice mattered. My stories deserved to be told. This wasn't just about me. It was about every voice yearning to be heard, every story waiting to be shared. The dream of a screen of my own, a platform to amplify those voices, took root in my soul. This was bigger than just television. This was about representation, about breaking down barriers, about shaping a world where every voice could rise and be celebrated. The internet age dawned, and with it, a new frontier YouTube. At first, I'll admit, I hesitated. This digital landscape felt foreign, untamed. Could this really be the future of storytelling? The thought of filming myself, sharing my thoughts and experiences with the world felt daunting. Would anyone even watch? Would my voice get lost in this vast digital ocean? But something inside me, that same fire that fueled my television dreams, whispered possibility. This new medium held a raw, unfiltered power. It was a chance to connect directly with audiences, bypassing the traditional gatekeepers. The potential impact was undeniable. YouTube wasn't just a platform, it was a movement, a democratization of storytelling. And I was being called to join the revolution. The media landscape was shifting again. Roku TV emerged, promising a new era of streaming entertainment. This wasn't just about watching videos anymore, it was about creating personalized experiences, curating content that resonated with individual passions. I saw an opportunity, a chance to not just share my story but to build a community. Roku TV became my bridge, connecting me with audiences hungry for diverse voices and authentic narratives. Then came COVID. The world as we knew it transformed. Lockdowns forced us into isolation, but it also accelerated our reliance on digital connection. Suddenly, the digital world wasn't just an option, it was a lifeline. For me, it was a pivotal moment. The pandemic highlighted the power of digital platforms to inform, to entertain, to connect us in a time of profound disconnect. It solidified my belief in the transformative power of digital media. The pandemic revealed another truth, the critical need for expert voices in the digital space. Doctors, scientists, educators, their knowledge was more vital than ever, yet many struggled to navigate the complexities of online platforms. I saw a new mission emerging, one driven by the belief that everyone with expertise deserves a platform. These experts, often so accustomed to traditional settings, needed guidance and support to harness the power of digital influence. This wasn't just about clicks or views. This was about empowering voices of reason and knowledge in a world grappling with uncertainty. It was about using digital tools to amplify messages of hope, resilience, and evidence-based guidance. The pandemic may have accelerated this need, but the mission extended far beyond the crisis. It was about building a future where expert voices were amplified, ensuring that knowledge and wisdom were readily accessible to all. But how do we bridge the gap between expertise and digital fluency? How do we empower those unfamiliar with algorithms and analytics to effectively share their knowledge online? The answer, I believe, lies in the power of AI. I poured my heart into developing AI tools designed specifically for experts. These tools would demystify the digital landscape, making it easier for them to identify their target audience, craft compelling content, and measure their impact. Receiving the 2024 Best of Best Award was an incredible honor, but more importantly, it added fire to the mission. This award proved I was on the right track. Creating AI tools and other resources to help empower experts to step into their digital power. It's about more than just technology. It's about building a movement where expert voices rise above the noise and where everyone has equal opportunity to share their gifts with the world. This is the future I envision, a future where digital platforms become beacons of knowledge and understanding, fueled by the wisdom of experts and amplified by the power of technology. This is a future I'm committed to building, one story, one connection, one click at a time.